When I think of rants, I think of one word. I think of integrity. Rants Crane himself is a brand. And when people say rants, you don't need to say rants who. You can take Rance out of the reporter role, but you can't take the reporter out of Rance. He's always going to be that, you know, his great love for Ad Age, and he talks about how much he loved being a reporter at Ad Age, and he's still doing that. I still get calls from him. Have you heard about this? I heard about this thing. Somebody told me this. You should follow up on this. So, you know, I think that's the mark of any good journalist is, is you can never sort of satiate that curiosity. To sit and listen to Rance talk about his time at Ad Age from being a reporter all the way up to editor-in-chief is like an oral history of the advertising business. He's a reporter first. There's nothing that makes, I think, Rance more excited or uh, more animated than when a big story's breaking. That's when he's happiest and that's when he's in his element and I always enjoyed being part of that. I don't think there's a person that's been involved in our business for a longer period of time, who's had a bigger impact on making the business better. Rance has been in my personal Hall of Fame for a long time. I've um, traveled with Rance. He took me to Russia once and tried to get me to buy some black market dolls, those little dolls, <laughs> and uh, got me in trouble. His curiosity is amazing to me. Rance is fearless. Right, whether it's standing behind a cause or launching a new business, doing what he thinks is right, and giving a voice to people who may not have one. He's a reporter. He's a writer, he's a reporter. That's when he's happiest. For him, it was always about the story. It was never about him. I mean, I, I know in his first days uh, as a reporter for the Northwestern, he was a sports reporter. And it, to this day, is still one of the biggest thrills of his life that he got to do that. That was, I think the Wildcats were good back then. But for him, it was a thrill of the chase of the story. It was about getting the story and getting it right. And that's what people love about him. More than anyone else in the business, in my opinion, Rance Crane serves as the conscience of advertising. You know, there's not, once you say that, there's not yeah. much else to say. Rance, congratulations on your induction into the Advertising Hall of Fame. So well-deserved and long overdue.